Walkers from across the region showed their support for Women's Place of South Niagara by taking part in the fifth annual Wave Walk at the Seaway Mall. The Way Walk is a Walk Against Violence Everyone event that supports our two domestic violence shelters here in Niagara Falls and Welland, uh, raising money to support our emergency shelters, our crisis lines, and our outreach counseling programs. Participants can expect to have a really good time. It's such a fun family event. It's a five kilometer indoor walk with games in between, and it's a lot of fun. Around 100 participants are registered for today. Uh, the event has been building year over year, so we're really excited. We had a goal of raising $22,000 this year and I think we're going to make it. Each year they invite a lived experience person to talk about their story in hopes of educating and inspiring participants. We're happy to have anyone that's used our services or been exposed to domestic violence share their story and the impact that it's had on them having access to these services. In 2018, every two and a half days a woman was killed by their intimate partner or spouse and our services are saving lives, so it's good to have people come out and support the event. Peggy Thompson is a survivor of domestic abuse. Unfortunately, when Peggy needed help, there wasn't the network of 600 women's shelters that now exist across Canada. I'm speaking at the walk because I have learned that by telling my story that I actually impact people. I just want women to know that it's not okay. And you become so brainwashed that you do believe it's okay. So if you hear the story of someone else, it could be worse than what's happened to you, it could be the same, and then you realize, I can get out of here. How does it feel to see all the support here today and everybody walking? It's amazing, it really is amazing because I still believe it's a taboo subject. As I was saying to a, a couple who has been helping, who have not been affected, by domestic violence. I asked them why, well why are you doing this then? The lady said well you know she said my mother just wasn't the greatest mother and um, I know people that this has happened to so this is what we're doing and we've raised a lot of money uh, from garage sales and things like that. So there's so many different reasons why people are helping and the women at Women's Place, the one who run, ones who run Women's Place, they are amazing. They, I mean, they're truly amazing. They're not just putting this on. They're truly caring and amazing. The ultimate goal is to raise awareness of domestic violence within the community and of the supports that are available to women and children that are fleeing abuse or exposed to abuse, and also to raise funds to support our operations. Last year, we serviced 260 women and children staying within our shelter. That's a lot of people from our community needing support and 2,988 support calls for people reaching out for shelter or for counseling or to do a safety plan came through on our 24-7 line. Viewers can show their support by donating online at womensplacesn.org. In Welland, I'm Mark Wickabredo reporting for The Source.